Within this lesson, we'll use our place value understanding to round multi-digit numbers to any place value. Here, we are asked to round 5,476. We're rounding this to the nearest thousand without using a number line. The first question that we ask then is between what two thousands is 5,476? It is in between 5,000 and 6,000. Next, we think about what is halfway in between 5,000 and 6,000. Halfway in between is 5,500. Is 5,476 less than or more than halfway between the two numbers? Right, it's closer to 5,000. It's less than that midway point. So 5,476, when we round it to the nearest thousand, is 5,000. Here we have 78,205 and it is about this number here. We're rounding to the nearest 10,000. And again, no number line this time. The question that we ask ourselves is between what two 10,000s is 78,205? And so it's actually in between 70,000, which is seven ten thousands or 80,000, which is 8 ten thousands. What's halfway in between those two ten thousands? Write 75,000. So this, and then we have the number 78,205. Is that less than the midway point or more than the midway point? Right, it's more than that midway point. 78,205 is more than the midway point, which was 75,000. So, it's actually closer to 80,000. Seventy-eight thousand rounded to the nearest 10,000 place is 80,000. Here we're asked to round to the nearest 10,000. Here's the 10,000 place with the 3 right there. How many 10,000s are in this number? There's 23 10,000s in this number. So we're rounding either to 23 10,000s or we're rounding to 24 ten thousands. Those are our lower end point and upper end point within our number line. Our midway point would end up being in between 230,000 and 250,000, which is 235,000. So our midway point again is 235,000. Now our question is whether this number here is less than our midpoint or more than our midpoint. In this case, it's less than our midpoint so that our number is going to be closer to our lower end point. And our lower end point was 23 ten thousands or 230,000 when we write it over in standard form. Therefore, 232,085 
is about 230,000. When we round it, and this number that is, to the nearest 10,000, it is 230,000. It's your turn to try. Go ahead and round each number to the greatest place, just using your place value understanding. Greatest place in this particular case for this first number would be the greatest place within the number and the greatest place is that digit to the furthest left. In this case, we're rounding this number to this place right here or to the th nearest thousand. With this number, the greatest place would be this one right here, and that greatest place then is the ten thousands. Pause that video while you work out these problems. For this first number, it was either closer to 3,000 or 4,000. The midway point is 3,500. 3,782 is more than that midway point. Therefore, it is, and the answer is, 4,000. 3,782 rounded to the greatest place, in this case, nearest thousand, is 4,000. For the second one, you should have gotten 20,000. We're rounding to the greatest place, which is going to be the 10 thousands place. And then that's why it is, it's 20,000. I could see how somebody might write 18,000. They would have not rounded to the greatest place. They would have rounded to the nearest thousand which is not the greatest place within this number. Let's take a look at this number here, 26,235. And the reason that I wrote it so many times here, we're going to round it to different places. To and so in for this first one, let's take this 26,235 and round it to that greatest place or to that nearest 10,000. And in this case, is it closer to two ten thousands or is it closer to three ten thousands? The midway point is 25,000, so it's actually closer to the upper end point or 30,000. For the next one, we're going to round instead to the thousands place. So we might say, round to the thousands place, or we might say, round to the nearest thousand. When we round that to the nearest thousand, sure, we have six here for the nearest thousand, or seven for that nearest thousand, and that would be 26,000 or 27,000. In this case, it is 26,000 because the midway point is 26,000. 500, and the 2 here is less than that 5, or 26,235 is less than 26,500, so it's closer to 26,000. When we round to the hundreds place, we would get 26,200. Now, are these all approximations or ways that we could round this number? Yes. We'll notice that we had 30,000 or 26,000, which is getting even closer to this number, or even 26,200. For that last one, if we went to the tens place, let's see what happens. It would be 26,000 what? In this case, 235 happens to be the midpoint, and remember, in that case, we round up 26,240. So our understanding of place value helps us round numbers.